Welcome back my YouTube family. I'm your instructor. My name is Rashid. As you know, we are diving deep into Tableau, learning one chart at a time. Today we have two exciting charts to explore. The first one is the stacked bar chart as you can see on your screen and the second one is the bar chart full 100% stacked. So let's start with the stacked bar chart. Look at the chart. You can see that this chart is a great for comparing different categories over time. Here we have the sales data split by region, central, north, south and southern for each month across two years 2021 and 2022. Each bar represent the total sales for a month and within the bar you can see the contributions for each region. For example in July 2021 the southern region marked in light blue contributed the most to the total sales followed by the central region in dark blue. Notice how this chart help us quickly see which region is leading in sales during any given month. It's a powerful way to visualize data when you want to compare multiple categories within a single period. So first of all we will be building the stacked bar chart. First I will put the date dimension into the column. Next I will add the sales measure to the rows. Tableau will initially display data as yearly. I will be clicking on this plus button on the date. Now our data divided with reference to the quarters. Now I will be clicking this plus button on the quarter and now you can see my sales with reference to the months. To add another layer of details I will drag the region dimension to the color. This will stack the bars by region. From the mark section I will select bar chart. Select entire view. Drag sales onto label. It will give you data labels as sales. Then select sales measure. Go to the format. From the pan select this number custom. Convert decimal to zero. More we can select unit of sales. Now we will be building a full 100% stacked bar chart. This chart will help us understanding the percentage contribution of each region to the total sales. This chart is perfect for comparing contribution of different regions to the total sales over a period. Instead of focusing on absolute values, it shows us the percentage of each region contribution to the total sales for each month. Notice how the chart displays sales data for 2021 and 2022. Broken down by region, each bar represent a month and the segments within the bar shows the percentage share of each region. First I will copy the same sheet we used for stacked bar chart. Now we have a similar chart to the previous one. In a 100% stacked bar chart, the total sale value is not important. Instead, we want to see the percentage contribution of each region. I will convert our scale from total sales to percentage ranging from 0 to 100%. I will go to the sales measure and click on the small triangle symbol. From the quick table calculation menu, percent of total. This changes our value from total sales to percentage of total but we are not done yet. The bars are not showing the correct length. To fix this I will click on the sales measure and go to edit table calculation. Here instead of table across I will select specific dimensions then I will click on region dimension only. Cross it. This chart shows the percentage contribution of each region to the total sales. It allows us to easily compare the performance of different regions as a part of the whole. It gives us a clear picture of how each region contributes to the overall sales percentage. And that's it for today's episode. I hope you found this episode helpful. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to the channel for more Tableau charts. See you in the next episode of this incredible playlist.